So these niggas couldn't get Chris Brown in trouble because of the old Rihanna allegations. So then they started the stupidest rumor. I don't I don't even know how y'all let stuff go viral. So yesterday it was this rumor that Chris Brown was wasn't letting the brown girls in his section while he's overseas, all right? I think he's in the UK right now and they were saying, "Oh, no. Nah, Chris Brown ain't got no black girls in his section." Now Chris Brown put this on Instagram and it's an image of him standing right next to a black girl at the club that they said he wasn't letting no black girls in his section at. I'm going to zoom it in. This girl next to him kind of looked like Megan Good, don't she? But he he's standing next to black girls. He he was in the club dancing. <laughs> Looking like you. Mm, 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 mm. I ain't gonna lie. Chris Brown got them his dog. But he's standing next to black women. But yet this whole thing went viral. Now then we had this girl from the UK basically explain the situation. And it wasn't Chris Brown who wasn't picking the brown girls. It was the promoter trying to get the white girls was waiting for our cab to go to the next location we could see club promoters literally handpicking people to get in the front of the line to go inside and uh at that moment the people that we saw that was handpicked was all white ladies that's why in my video you can see that we're trying to say that the promoter said no black girls allowed that's not chris brown it's the promoter and of course a uk promoter is going to try to get the white girls in the club. You know what I mean? Bear in mind, guys, they said their club can only contain up to 300 people, but there was up to a thousand of ladies literally standing outside waiting to get inside the club. And ladies, common, we know this. Like, us Londoners, we know this. Like, stuff like this happen literally every single day in London when you come to club and, like, and the people that promote stuff on the internet and stuff like that. So let's not make this about Chris Brown. I might have to make a part to you guys. But that's a fact. That's why I said that. If you kind of go overseas, you know, like, they, they kind of push the white girls, especially in the UK. Um... A lot of people, when they think of Europe, they don't really even think that it's black people in Europe. You know what I mean? And that's just because in the UK, it's almost like sometimes they like to hide the black people. <laughs> so, yeah. All right. So that's basically it. Um, Like I said, y'all, I, I, I don't know what it is about Chris Brown this week. They really just trying to get my nigga out of the paint. I never seen so much hate for a light skinned nigga. I, I, I don't know, man. Now, it might be because it's Black History Month. And I'm going to tell y'all, all black people watching this, y'all notice like during the year, it starts to be a push for either dark-skinned niggas or light-skinned niggas. And, it, and, and right now, they might be trying to get the light-skinned niggas out of here so the dark-skinned niggas can flourish, all right? I know that new season of Snowfall is coming out. You know what I mean? So they, they trying to open it up for the dark skin brothers, all right? Let me know what y'all think about this. Make sure you like the video and subscribe. I'll see y'all next time. Peace.